action begins. Our referee in charge, Jorge Alonso. Jorge Alonso, our referee. First fight in over a year for Nate Diaz. Ariani, Brittany, Chrissy, Vanessa, and Luciana all here. There's Johnson, Diaz. Here we go. Both men southpaw. White trunks for Johnson, black trunks for Nate Diaz. Johnson said, and I quote, I'm the fastest guy in the division. Well, Nate Diaz is long, and he has excellent boxing, Mike. And Michael Johnson's going to have to get in on that reach. One factor could very well be the kicks of Johnson, because Nate Diaz stands very heavy and low. There we see it. Very heavy and low on that front leg. And he had a real hard time with Rafael Dos Anjos in his last fight, who also fights as a southpaw and utilized that weapon we just saw Johnson go to twice early in the fight. Yeah, lefty versus lefty, so Joe, it kind of cancels each other out. Yeah, it's, it's very similar to right. two orthodox fighters, Absolutely. which makes that front leg a, a target. And Michael Johnson, of course, is doing a lot of kickboxing, a lot of Muay Thai. I like how he went to the body there. Nate checked that one. <laughs> to the midsection with that lead jab for Johnson. He said he can't handle my pressure, can't handle my speed. A journey that began in 2011 for the St. Louis, Missouri native Michael Johnson. And there was a good kick by Nate. Yep. No taunting or anything yet. Just a good pace to the beginning of this fight, Joe. Very impressed with the kind of condition Nate has gotten in for this fight. You can tell he's really taking it seriously. Is that is about as lean yeah. and ripped as we've ever seen him inside the octagon. And you know, Nick and Nate are never really not in good condition, triathletes. But yeah, Nathan, as they call him, he's definitely ready to put on a show here tonight. Wants to get back right into that title picture. He believes he's the best lightweight in the world. Not surprising that he believes that. That front leg is already getting chewed up. It's going to be a big factor in this fight if Johnson continues to slam home. There's a good right hand by Nate Diaz, and he smiled at Johnson. And now he's talking to him. Oh, and then he tagged him to the left, and he's dropping his hands. Nate's last fight was in Phoenix against the champion, Rafael Dos Anjos. Looks to defend his title for the first time later on Fox against Cowboy. Another solid jab by yep. Nate. He's starting to get loose with his boxing, Mike. And his boxing is his best weapon, undoubtedly. Pretty flawless on the ground, too. Longtime Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt. Yeah, he has a very, very dangerous guard should it go to the ground. Nate's doing a good... Oh, got caught. But Nate's no, doing a nice job of range there. He's just staying a little bit outside of Johnson's strikes like that. Yeah. Job. His boxing looks very good. Yeah. Again, Johnson's having a real hard time with that jab, Mike. That right jab. Oh, Nate Diaz getting loose. And he's laughing at him now. Yeah. He's ducking under Johnson's counters and mocking him now. Michael Johnson, very raw talent when he was on The Ultimate Fighter. Nate Diaz won his season of The Ultimate Fighter. Back in 2007. Trying to double up on that kick. Michael the Menace Johnson. Nate's really starting to flow nicely. There's that leg kick again. Moving well out of the way of that Johnson left hand, though. Looking for a little slip and rip. He just gets out of harm's way. Wants to fire right back. Again with a kick, though. Michael Johnson working with Henry Hooft and the great team at the Black Zillions. Johnson going to the inside leg kick as well now. The chance of Diaz emerged to the crowd. Oh, there's another leg kick. Joe Nate said he really loved this fight coming into this week because he feels, and we see it here, Michael Johnson's the guy who's playing him back. Hard kick to the body by Johnson. Yep, and he's doing exactly that. Johnson getting more comfortable here in the final minute of the first round. Johnson is chewing up that right leg. That's what Dos Anjos did against Nate Diaz. Leg kicks to win that fight. It was a giant factor in their fight. Yep. Checked. 
this is exactly what we'd hope we would see with this matchup. So yeah. far, so good. Yeah, this is exactly what we thought was going to take place. Yeah. And it's very interesting so far. Good left hand over the top by Diaz. Good right hand by Diaz. Diaz. Johnson. Round two. Henry Hoof said in the corner, Michael Johnson, relax. You're doing very well. Don't play with him. Don't play the game. Richard Perez, Jake Shields in the corner of Nate Diaz tonight to the body. And Diaz's corner wanting him to check that kick yep. or counter as he's throwing. And there's that kick again. Now Michael Johnson is lightning fast. He certainly is, and he is... And Nate, look at this, Nate switched stance. And when a guy switches stance, it's normally a southpaw. It's because his leg hurts. Absolutely. One of the guys who handles strength and conditioning at the Black Zillions is Tony Bellani. He said athletically he wants to make Michael Johnson like an NFL DB. Oh, those guys are athletic. Nate just caught him with a nice one-two. Nate moves just out of the way, and there's that jab you nice talked jab. about, Joe. Very nice, clean jab. Again, good fight. Nate's reach advantage is really coming into play here. Notice how he pops that jab and then slides right out of the range of the counter. Johnson saying, if I win this fight, I deserve the next title shot. We'll talk about that later. Title's on the line in our main event. Another nice jab by Nate. Mike Goldberg, Joe Rogan, Johnson Diaz on Fox. Bantamweight champion. Dominic Cruz will join us in the broadcast booth for the main event. Nate Diaz is really scoring with his jab, Mike. There it is again. Yep. Pawn it out there. What's really disturbing the rhythm of Michael Johnson. Ever since Nate teed off with a few earlier in this round, Johnson's been tentative. Check our head check some of those. Oh, that's a good left hand by Johnson. There's that jab again, but a good kick by Johnson. Nate's starting to talk just a little bit. They did have a bit of a discussion at the end of the first. Oh, stand change. and trade. Oh, this is wild. Big fight for Michael Johnson. Nate Diaz, not very active the last few years. He wants to get back on it, work his way towards the top again. Another chant of Diaz. Good left hand over the top by Johnson. A nice jab as well, but a nice jab by Nate. Just over two on the clock here in round oh, two. The good counter left hand by, by Johnson. Johnson. Both guys connected there. This is wild. Absolutely. That right hook, boom. Nate's doing a good job of checking much different, that, isn't it, Joe? Yeah, that much inside different. leg kick. Look at this exchange. Michael's not really throwing the leg kicks as he did in round one. On to the outside. And I think that's because Nick continues, pardon me, Nate continues to pressure him like this. Yeah, he's putting a lot of pressure and he's landed a lot. There he yeah. goes again. Oh, he heard him there. And Nate just pointed to him and said, oh, I heard you. Look at that. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Diaz brothers. Oh, oh, oh but Michael, Michael Johnson. Scored. This is the kind of fight Nate Diaz oh. always wants. Somebody willing to stand and trade. Michael Johnson, that man here. Michael Johnson got hit with some hard shots in this round. And Mike. another one. And again, and Nate is doing a great job of ducking under the potential counters. Look at this. And Nate's in his head now. Yep. Oh, again. Nate really... Switched his stance up a little bit there. And Michael oh, Johnson said, a, you know what? You still got a fight, buddy. I'm still in this hand. thing. Good left hand by Johnson. Yeah, good answer by Johnson here in and the another final one. minute. One, two. Look at that. Again and again. Uh-oh. And Joe, again. Michael Johnson talked about the speed. I don't think we've ever seen Nate Diaz faster than he is tonight. I think the time off renewed him. Yes. I think he needed that time. Head kick by Nate. I think it renewed his enthusiasm, and it certainly 
aided him in his strength and conditioning. Whatever he's done, he looks fantastic. Been riding long distances on his bike for years. Again, he was 18. Oh, Johnson got tagged with that right hook. Clinch, final 10 seconds, knees. Good round for Diaz. Trying to lock it up. Good right hand on the break. Get your hands back after you throw. Five minutes remain. Well, he's not playing with him. He's just having a really hard time with excellent boxing. Nate Diaz is landing that nice right jab, and there you see it again, and he stunned Michael Johnson several times in that round. Nate is also doing a really good job. Nate's also doing a really good job of sliding away from the counters. Michael looking to touch gloves real quickly there. Nate says we'll do that later, maybe. Good back and forth battle. Really good second round for Diaz. Showing a potential spin. Nate says, Joe, he visualizes the negative and that motivates him to prepare for fights like this. At the end of the day, it's whatever works for the individual competitor. Michael has turned headhunter now. Yeah. There's that leg kick again. And Henry Hoof was calling for combinations. He's calling to use his footwork. Oh, nice one too again, by Look Nate. at that. Johnson not able to land, but he threw about five or six counters. Kid from Stockton against the kid from St. Louis. Nice. He's blocking most of those. He's checking the kicks now as well. Oh, nice one, too, and slides away again. Again. Oh, he stunned him, Mike. He stunned him. He stumbled with that. Good right hook there. Oh, head kick. Well done. Wow. Nate Diaz, first fight in 371 days. Oh! And again, he clips up. Beautiful. Nate Diaz has never looked better. Another sharp jab. One, two. Knee up the middle. Another knee. Another one. And backs away. And Johnson just holding on in front of us here in the clinch. Not doing anything. Literally just trying to recover. He's exhausted. And he's getting lit up. Oh, another one, two lands. Great pace to this fight. Joe at UFC 141 against Cowboy. Diaz set a UFC record with 238 significant strikes. He may break that record, his own record tonight. Beautiful jab to the body. Nate Diaz has never looked better, Mike. Checks the kick. Step in elbow. Nice right hook. Wow, Henry Hooft is yeah, yelling out, give don't give up. Wow. Michael tried to go body, clipped him in the head. Nate able to take a lot of this punishment and double up the return. There's that jab again. Oh, beautiful one, too. The output of Diaz, incredible tonight. That jab is a huge factor in this fight. There's a nice right hand by Michael. And a nice inside leg kick as well. And there's that counter left. We haven't seen that outside leg kick, though, since round one for Johnson. Nate was able to work through it. Still taunting. Nate's doing a much better job of checking the leg kicks as well, particularly the inside kick. Diaz up the middle. Nate again just gets out of the way. Johnson, though, trying to be aggressive he here there. right to the finish. He slipped there looking for a jab to the body. Again, the don't yeah, give don't up. Give up. Richard Perez. Oh, beautiful one, too, by Nate. Boxing coach for the Diaz brothers for so long. Gotta love this performance. Under a minute now. Oh! Again with that lead left. That time a hook. Followed up. Lead right, pardon me, with that left hand. Southpaw jab again. having a hard time reaching him now, Mike. Here's, an, again, another jab and a one-two. To 
amazing how just a little bit of a reach advantage can make a huge difference inside the octagon. Well, a little reach advantage and some very good skill. Yeah. And again, Nate has never looked better, and particularly against one of the most dangerous contenders in the division. Oh, got hit with a right hand. Oh, things get interesting now. Yeah, but this. only 10 seconds left. Look at this. He's looking for a guillotine. Final seconds of this fight. Diaz and Johnson go the distance. Oh, look at this. Johnson's kicking him while he's down. Wow. Here's a straight left. A lot of sharp right hand jabs. There's a right hook and a straight left behind it. Beautiful boxing by Nate Diaz. There's another clean straight left hand and ducks under the counters. And here's the end. Let's see the end here. The bell rolls. Nate's on top. He goes for a knee bar. Oh, that's why Michael's kicking him, because he had a knee bar on him. Yeah. Well, he deserved it. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 29, 28 for the winner. By unanimous decision, Nate Diaz! the winner Nate Diaz. Nate, it's been a long time, been a year since we've seen you in the octagon, but you have never looked sharper. This was a beautiful performance against a very tough guy in Michael Johnson. How do you feel about it? Yeah, Conor McGregor, you're taking everything I work for. I'm going to fight your ass. You know what's the real fight, what's the real money fight is me, not these clowns that you already punked at the press conference. Don't no one want to see that. You know you beat them already. That's the easy fight. You want that real right here. Hey, and I'm not. Unfortunately, we can't talk like that on Fox. Congratulations, Nate, on a spectacular victory. <laughs> Nate Diaz. All right, we'll see, Conor McGregor.